I think organisations should be considering cloud services as part of their IT strategy for three main reasons. The first one is it's very scalable, so it gives them the opportunity to, to grow and increase capacity as their demands increase. The second one is agility, so it gives them the ability to respond very quickly. Typically it would have taken four to six weeks to deploy a server and a service. Now you could do that in a matter of hours and minutes. And I think the third one, which will probably be most important for people, is cost savings. Typically you can reduce capital expenditure and operating expenditure if you move services to the cloud. I think the key benefits for cloud services from RedCentric are firstly personalisation. Whilst probably 80% of the services that we deliver are very standard, we have the ability to, to really personalise that last 10 or 20% to make a solution fit ideally to a, to a client. The second one is that we own everything from the data centre through to the network, so we can take end-to-end -end responsibility and, and control. And the third one really is our heritage and pedigree in managed services. So not only do we provide the data centre this solution, we provide all the help desk services, incident management, uh, first, second and third line support. So really with our managed service heritage, we can offer a complete service around cloud and service delivery. When it comes to the cloud, we do things very differently because we focus on the end user and their experience of using applications. Many cloud service providers will focus on fairly meaningless service level targets like power delivery to the data center and they'll guarantee 100% availability. But what really matters is the end user's experience. So you need to focus not only on the data center and the power, but the network, the way the application performs and how it really feels to be a user at work or at home trying to do your job. So ultimately, we don't focus on meaningless service statistics, we focus on the user and their experience. Redcentric's learned a huge amount from deploying cloud solutions in the real world over the last two to three years. The first thing we do is help our customers make sure that their current infrastructure is right before they move it to the cloud because what you don't want to do is to bring any existing problems with you into the new cloud environment. The second thing is we make sure we follow the same rigorous requirements gathering and design process that we would have done for any other infrastructure solution that we would deliver for our customers. Just because it's a cloud solution, you can't cut corners. The third thing is we ask our clients to have somebody who's ultimately responsible for receiving a cloud service from us. So this is somebody who works with our service delivery managers to make sure that they're getting the best from us and that we're doing the very best that we can for our client. <laughs>